Hello friends and fellow farmers, we're back with some more kind seed. Now again, before we start, I just want to remind people that we're playing a beta and the game is not finished, so you know, we can't expect everything and there, there may be bugs. So we just want to remind people of that before we get going here. Just in case the game does anything funky or crashes, it's not the, the game's fault. It's a work in progress. All right, and we will go back to where we were. Good morning, and there's my bag of cash. <laughs> As someone kindly pointed out to me that where it was, I think we noticed it right after we were done last time. We were like, oh, there's the bag of cash. There's so many details in this game that I find I, I'm overlooking a lot of stuff. Father, well done. You can use that bucket for a bunch of purposes. All right, go try it out. Yes, we will. So we need to get, uh, I think that we needed to get some milk for somebody. And uh, we're going to grab some blueberries. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Strawberries forever in a field full of beetles. Okay. Uh, use a wooden bucket to scoop up the poo. Coming soon. <laughs> That's what the signage reminds us. Let's go feed our, our piggy friend. Okay, piggy friend. Um, let's give you some food. And we'll give you today... How about, well, we'll give you an apple. We got a lot of those. And Piggy has water. Guess we should go make our offering over here. And once again, I think we'll, let's see, what do we have a lot of? I think we'll go with a, uh, an apple again. All right. Uh, okay, which one was, there we go. So get a sickle from a blacksmith, right? Uh, learn how to cook. So buy seeds from market. Well, we got to do that one. And uh, I guess we could, let's see here. Uh, no, I don't want to do anything with my, oh, father, ambivalent. I love the way you can just pull these things up. Okay, items, uh, let's equip this bucket. Can I, no, I don't know that I can milk, maybe he's busy right now. We were trying that last time, I think. All right, that's fine. Let's go check this out. What's going on here over here? Oh, use L trigger to view status of objects. Yes. Are these things done? No, they're still growing. Okay. Um, oh, maybe we should uh, use our watering can. We'll water these things. I'll, I'll figure all of this out. I, I think I said last time, I, I finally... It's it's us. Greetings. Sibling. Ambivalent. Oh, we collected honey. Reminder added. You can collect honey if you have the right container. Okay. I see. I've totally been ignoring all of the little the things at the beginning of the game. Okay, we've got some poppy. That's more dandelion. Now, I'd like to go down in uh, in search of some more of those little shrine things. We'd found one that we couldn't quite get to. Um, I don't know. Oh, hey, hello. Oh, there's one more to find. Did we already see that one? Is that the deal? And then we'll get a bit of a map. Okay, so that that uh, <laughs> that thing at the top must be a clock of sorts. Ooh, I think we'll stay away from this dude. He looks a bit sketchy. But we will take his apples. Good morning, chickens. Wow, there's so many details. Okay, and what was this? I, I don't recall what that was about. Oh, okay, we'll go visit this, this dude. Herbert Lemon. No, 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 you shall not go. No, no, indeed. Come of age and you can go through the gate. Got my eyes on you, Herbert sees all. Okay, Herbert. Uh, I think I'm going to stay clear of Herbert for the moment. Herbert is a little... Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, look at this. What does the shrine do? So we made an offering. I have no idea. Doesn't seem like anything bad happened. I have no idea what this is about. Hmm. Oh, we found another one of these uh, little proverbs. 
proverb cuckoo do number one. Cuckoo do will only grow before noon says hello. This is closed. Okay. Must be another mine or something. Man, what a lovely amount of uh, places and information. Let's go down here and check it out. Hmm. So what does this sign say? Okay, Candlewick Village South, Vale Gate North. So I guess that is something to do with getting out of the Vale, I guess? No idea. Oh, there's another map stone. Have we seen this one? Mapped region. Check out the map screen to... F okay, perfect. Ah, there we go. Beautiful. So this is the region. Okay. So I don't know how we... Uh, how do we... Are we able to zoom in at all on this? Oh. Not at this point. It doesn't look like... X toggle, toggle world map B close. Oh, I see. Uh... Aha, oh, wow. I see, so we've we've kind of explored Northgate. That's cool. Okay. It's a sign giving us some directions. So it really does encourage you, this game, uh, to s just slow down and really take in everything. Okay, I guess we'll give another... Again, I don't know what this thing does. We've made some offering. Moon Whisper Ruin, east. Testy Acres, south. So what is a Moon Whisper Ruin? And is seriously, is the day kind of already winding down on us? Oh my. Oh, okay, awesome. We mapped another era, another region. So Drew to Cross, we've mapped out. Excellent. Oh, what's, what's going on here? I we found another proverb. Proverb blood few two, or one. Blood few can only be found by strange face statues on the ground. Okay. Uh-oh. I think we're getting really late. Uh, Moss Whisper Rune. Okay, I have no idea. If, oh, no, this does not look like we are anywhere near home. Let's get this proverb and get out of here. Proverb rainbow mushrooms number one. Rainbow mushrooms like to sprout just after summer rains about. Okay, good to know. You know what else is good to know? How to get out of here, because it doesn't seem like a very nice area to be at night. I don't think we want to be here after dark. Let's boogie. Oh, we got some grapes. Okay. It was sparkling away. Okay, so now, yeah, that's nice. We can, we have a better sense of where we're going and whatnot. Excellent. Okay, and then we'll, yeah, I think this was the way home up here. So we kind of explored down into the right. And we are at home, almost. Bloop. And there we go. Well, that's excellent. Okay. Huh. Okay, I don't know what to do with all that. Let's just go to bed. Um, okay, we'll sleep until 6 a.m. Day 6. Weather is expected to be mostly sunny with a 10% chance of rain. Two brass waiting to collect. Okay. I see, we get a little bit of brass for completing each of the, uh, the the tasks ahead of us here. Like this task, making an offering and feeding the pig. Beautiful. All right, let's go grab another apple here. Now I wonder what happens when seasons change. This is a very mysterious land. Like, I feel very, uh, like there's just going to be so much to, to discover in this game. Oh, I didn't quite get that apple. There we go. 
I'm going to go kind of a little bit to the east here. I'm kind of curious what's over this way. I see. Okay, there's a broken bridge there. It's a fishing spot. Let's go up. Oh, there's a dandelion. We will take it. We've gone over a little bridge to the north, entering Dreamer's Nook. Yeah, this game really invites you to get into, like, find every little area. Map to region. There we go. Okay, uh, talk a local map. Oh, there we go. Nice. Oh, yeah, and I see a, a proverb, but we're gonna need to, we're gonna need something to go and get that. The Right Angle by Rod Holladum. Demu? Demu? Fishing is a science, except for science does not exist anymore. So fishing is less like a science, whatever that was, and more like a feeling. The feeling of sitting or standing in the right conditions or left conditions and waiting for the shadows of the fish to come to your hook. A little rippling action might persuade one to come a nibbling, but don't ripple when one is near, or you will scare them like Grandpa Breadhand scares children who smell of jam. Some advanced fishermen know a few tricks that can make a, you a wizard with a rod, except wizards do not exist, and I simply made up that word, as it sounded magical. And lastly, do not forget to adhere to the proverb, some fish like rain, some moonlight, some summer, some even like loot, loot music. Hope these tips were helpful. I don't like fishing myself, I just like writing tips about fishing. Other books by this author include Carpe Diem, Breaking the Gold Goldfish Code, The Doctor Who Fishes, with foreword by Patrick Troughton, Fat Hookers and Other Type of Lure, Types of Lure, Sharks, Just What They Are They and What Is the Sea, Five Star Fish, Quality or Quantity. All right, thank you, uh, fish author. I also don't care for fishing a whole lot, even in games, but it's one of those things we seem to have to keep doing. Oh boy. Oh, that's, uh, let's talk to this person. Twig. Hello. You're that new kid on the farm, ain't you? Nobody ever comes around to my old nook. Name's Twig, but you can call me Twig. We can be best of friends if you catch me some lunch. Use that old rod there. Just pull up the right trigger and aim with the right stick. Catch me a nice fishy and I'll teach you a trick. Okay, assigned to a slot. Uh, yeah, we'll go... Uh, let's see. Oh, uh, I want to do... There we go. Oh, um. Okay, I'm going to, yeah, let's do that. Oh, beautiful. Okay, look at this. Ooh, we're gonna go fishing. We're gonna go fishing. I'm fishing for something somewhere. Ah, so there we go. Oh, look at that. Okay, I can't quite reach it from here. Let's go over here. How do you draw it in? I'm drawing, okay, so I'm, I'm drawing on my right trigger to do a fission. Hmm. Cast and reel. Oh, RB to ripple, I see, okay. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to be able to catch this thing. Oh. Well, maybe I can't do that. I have no idea. Okay, let's go for some fish now. Oh, I see some fishies are interested. Uh, 
Aha, fish drawn to scale. So there we go, there's fishing. So we give it a little a little jiggle and then they, they get uh, attracted by the lure. It's interesting. Oh, I see. There we go. They see it. There we go. Collected item fish. Hmm. We'll see if this this fishy takes the... Oh, it's starting to rain. I think we're done with fishing for the moment. That's cool. So let's go back up and talk to uh, Twig. Twig, just bring me any old fish and gift it to me from the interaction menu. All right. Now you can hook items with a fishing rod. Oh, I see. Now we know how to do that. Okay. Wow. Oh, there's another book here. Let's check it out. Twig's torn out diary note. I'm going to meet Mr. Fairweather tonight. I have my dark light ready in my lantern. I'm very scared, but Mr. Fairweather told me in my dreams that it will all be well, and I will be the best fisherman in Quill and the fastest runner. He is Felfay. I read that they are the tricksters or shapeshifters, but I think those are just stories to scare children. I'm more scared about going in that old mine, but I have the key in my lantern, and I will drink some moonshine before I go. If anyone finds this, and I have not returned to tear out this page, please give my belongings as an offering to the goddess goddesses and tell them i'm sorry for what i did and not to bring me back as a moth as i hate bright light that could be a problem if that's your concern all right so let's go and check out that proverb that uh, is over there now now maybe we can get it now that we know how to hook things um we'll see oh maybe not Oh, yeah, we did. <gasps> oh, yeah. Proverb checkered chub number one. Checkered chub may catch your sight under the cloak of Aurora's night. Don't know what that means. Doodly do. Doodly 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 do. This looks like uh, over here. This is like tree branches. This is interesting. Something going on there. Looks secretive. I do not know. Okay, and that was all there was there. All right, let's check out down. Now we're back on the farm. So let's continue. Um, yeah, so there's gonna be family tree information on the, the monument stones. I'm just gonna kind of go around and confirm that we've seen Truffles the pig ate the key, find a way to get it out. Oh. Oh, that's interesting. So there's a key to the mine here. So is there a whole pile of different mines? That's interesting. If there is. Let's see. Hey, Truffles. Uh... Let's feed Truffle some, some honey. Let's feed Truffle's a fish. If I feed Truffle's too much stuff, Truffle's will just... Cabbage seems like a good thing to feed a pig. Nope. Nothing yet. Oink. Indeed, truffles. Oh, hey, there's another little proverb down here. Let's go and get that one. And this dandelion. What do we got here? 
Proverb Grace Lilac number one. The ancient dead don't rise at night because they fear the lilac white. Okay. I see. So all around the farm, there was these little signs, which were just tooltips that I just ignored initially. Because <laughs> why, why get the tooltips that are going to be totally helpful in playing a game that you barely understand how to play? You know, I, sh I should read signage more. I, I think I get so excited when we start a new game like this that I just am like, woohoo, I want to I want to see and do everything. Okay, now maybe I can get... Can I get it from here? Maybe I can use my fishing rod in order to... Uh, let's see here. So I want to change my inventory item over to you. Oh, now we want to select that and go down. Ah, there we go. Proverb number one. Apples tend to make things swell when inner gas is left to dwell. Undiscovered trait, gassy. Oh, okay. So we do, I think if we do just give the pig a pile of apples, I think the pig is going to uh, blurt out a key for us. That's my suspicion. Okay, so we're going to do that tomorrow. <laughs> well, we'll do that next time. I think we'll stop here. And uh, next time we come back, we're going to uh, continue on here with Kind Seed. All right, we'll sleep till morning. We'll see you then. Bye-bye.